Hi guys, welcome back to my bathroom, but this isn't my bathroom. I'm in Mexico and we thought I, this would be a perfect time to do a little vacation skincare, um, pool, beach makeup, kind of all together. How I keep my skin from peeling after getting burnt in the sun on like day one, which we all tend to do. Sunscreen people. So, hope you enjoy these little tips and tricks. It's just a quick couple products for glowy vacation skin. Enjoy. Okay, first things first, I don't really wash my face when I'm kind of, so Mexico, we're pretty dry. We go from ocean to pool, to tanning, to golf, to hiking. I find with the dry climate, I don't get greasy like at all. So I kind of just rinse with water. So no harsh products. Um, if I wear makeup, I just kind of take it off with a little bit of cream or oil and that's about it. So rinse face, whatever you want. If you wanna wash, great. Just find that it dries out even more. So we wanna put all the moisture back into your skin. So I'm gonna start with a little, uh, this one, this lemon skin, um, rose gold brightening facial treatment mask. I'm gonna put this on and I'm gonna let it marinate for about five, 10 minutes. And I'm gonna have a nice coffee while I do that. Because I feel with a burn, you just get a little bit tight. So you wanna put up any tightness. I love this one because it's jelly. Perfect. I'm gonna let this marinate with a little nice coffee. I'll be back soon. So it's been about 10 minutes. Just gonna oh, remove that sucker. Kind of press the serum into my skin. Down the back. That might be enough serum for some people, honestly. But we're doing a bit of traveling today, so I think I want to load up on the moisture. I'm gonna go with this random step. Avene thermal water, spring water, just great for a burn. If you need a little refresh, we know. I love a mist. Perfect, so we're right in the middle step, whatever. Okay, then for serums, I'm gonna go in with two. Both Beekman 1802, still obsessed, still here, still part of my regimen. I'm gonna mix the Golden Booster, which is like a vitamin C um, and amala berry serum. Amala berry? Amala berry, not amala. This one, and then I'm gonna mix it with my milk drops because this can be a bit harsh and you should actually, um, how they tell you to do it is you take the bloom cream and you kind of mix the vitamin C with the bloom cream. However, I'm not gonna use a moisturizer today, so I'm just gonna go ahead and kind of um, lighten the intensity of the vitamin C with the milk drops. So, so we're gonna take a little, it's like, that's like two drops in one big, one big drop, basically. I'm gonna take the milk drops, two, three, four, and I'm just gonna rub those in together. And this vitamin C serum is so good. Sometimes I don't go with vitamin C when I'm in the sun because it could be a bit harsh for your skin. However, I have not had any problems with this one. And again, you can lighten the load with a little moisturizer. Do a little lymphatic drainage. We've kind of been on a detox here. We haven't had anything to drink. We've been golfing, so really feeling not bloated at all, which has been wonderful. Get your hands. Okay. So let that kind of sit in there. Hope everyone is doing well. Hope it's spring. His spring has sprung where you guys are. There's a little coconut syrup, coconut milk, and an espresso. So that's basically it for the skincare. You can, if I'm going to bed, I will do follow up with a moisturizer. However, it is daytime. We're going out. So I'm gonna do a quick little five second skin.
skin routine. So I'm going to mix my SkinCeuticals SPF 50 tinted, uh, it's a little bit tinted, it's like it even skin tone, so it's slightly tinted, and I'm going to mix it with my um, anti-pollution drops, the sunshine drops, which, as you know, if you have seen the other videos, gives you a bit of a golden bronzy color. So all I'm gonna use is like that much and then pump like two babies because it's it's quite a lot. So it'll just give me that glow that I really, really love. See it's just the perfect, it like matches my skin perfectly. Sure you get the next so you don't have any lines like it's just that subtle tint while evening out any imperfections oh God. just feels so good okay so it may it may not look like much but honestly if you look closely it just kind of fills in the lines evens out the skin tone Gives me a little sunscreen. Then literally just gonna brush my brows up. It's greasy. Brush my brows up a little. You could do a little highlighter if you like, but I'm just gonna swim this off so I'm not even gonna bother. Define the brows, you can little trick that I like to do is I tint if I can get a lash lift perfect, but I can't just a little tint on the eyelashes so I don't feel the need to wear mascara. And for the lip moisturizer today I'm gonna to use the Kopari um, coconut lip balm. That is a literally it. I wasn't trying to talk to you guys. This would be done in three seconds. That is my vacation skincare routine, skincare, makeup, all the works. If I'm going to a restaurant, I might put a little highlighter on my eye and my cheekbones, my nose, maybe, maybe a lip color. But honestly, with the tan and the glow and the sun, this is all I need. So. Hope this helps you on your potential next vacation. Hope things are opening up where you are. Um, and stay safe, guys. Enjoy. And we'll see you next time. Bye.